All right, YouTube, trucking the life here again. I know it's dark time, but could you see back there? See them red and blue lights back there? State police got me hemmed up, man. And they got light out too, man. The heat is doing an inspection on me, man, with a light out. I took my permit book and my license, and I don't know what he go. I don't know what he gonna do with it, but I don't know, guys. First time to get got in the wild, man. Everybody get their time to get got. It's my time to get got, man. Trying to get on back and get on in, man. Coming on off this long run, and and he got me hemmed up. What you go? I'm gonna do run from the state police. But anyway. Yeah, they yeah, got me, YouTube. I don't know what's gonna happen to this man. I don't know what he got going on back there. But I know it's, I know one thing. I know one thing. He did a brake test on me. Did a light thing. You gotta, gotta check the lights. Did all that stuff. My signals, look at my tires and all that stuff. So. I don't know there. I think he got me for that light though. He, he said he got to do 32 inspections a year. So that light right there, I just went out a couple days ago, man. I don't know if you guys can see it on the side right there. Just went out, he went back there with my stuff, so I don't know what's gonna happen, man. One good thing about this whole thing though is um he ain't sitting about putting me out of service. He ain't sitting like that. As long as we put me out of service, I'm okay. If he come up with it, if I see a ticket book in his hand, then I realize something. I got got. I got got. Man, I thought it was too cold to be doing inspections on the side of the highway, but I guess not, man. Anyway, he was a cool, he a cool officer though, man. I mean, he leveled with me, I asked him some questions. He leveled with me and everything, man. But um, that don't negate the fact that I'm I'm hemmed up right now. He back there with his lights on, and me sitting on the side of the road right now. But anywho, what's new, man? What's new, YouTube? This is this is regular trucking stuff right here. This ain't that real stuff. I got through that stuff. Now I gotta get through this. He did a brake test because he thought, uh, I guess he thought he saw he thought he heard air leaking. But I don't know, man. I don't know. He said he said it was cool on that part, but I know I got that light out over there, so I don't know what he gonna do about that. Hi right, YouTube, made it to the rail yard. Finally. Still gotta go on. The job still gotta get done even though. Hold on. The job still gotta get done even though. <clears throat> even though I got a DOT inspection. It's getting a little dark guys, stay tuned. YouTube, made to the rail yard. Gotta lock these pins. Yeah, man, that, that DOT inspection board was uh, it's a little hairy. I'll tell you that. Well, I ain't want. I don't even want. I want to keep driving after that. You coming this way? Hold on, guys. Hold on.
I got a uh, Stay tuned, I gotta unlock this real quick. Hold on, hold on. Alright, YouTube, I still gotta work, even though I don't want to. Like I said, the DOT inspection kinda. Man, everybody got their time to get got. I showed you what, what I got got going on, what I got got on. Hold on, guys. Hold on, guys. Stay dark in here. I want you guys to be able to see me. So I'm ready to pull up right here, finish this vlog right quick, and then I'm going to get up the road. Alright, stay tuned. Crane's over there working. Crane's over there working too. But anyway, yeah, like I say, after I got that DOT inspection, I didn't want to keep going, but check it out. This, this is what he got me on right here. Look. Power unit, windshield wiper uh, def operative or defective. All I, I, I didn't have no windshield wiper fluid in there, so he got me for that. Uh, portable ELD, not mounted to or fixed to position. Visible to driver. I don't have an ELD, I have an onboard recorder, so it don't have to be fixed to the vehicle. But he wrote me up on that. He gave me warning for all these, which I'm glad. I wrote my own little things in there, so that my so that my safety department know what, know what happened. Even though I already talked to him verbally, but I put it on here anyway. Then right here it says first trailer, inoperable required lamp, rear clearance lamp. Okay, that's my lights is off. Now these lights right here. And that no rear registration play light, all that's on the same circuit. <clears throat> so both phone was off. So of course they both gonna be off at the same time. So we got me for that. Like I was saying, when he pulled me over, he didn't pull me over and let me know what he pulled me over for until after the inspection was done. So once the inspection was done, then he said, okay, your lights was out. Now imagine you, I had a light out on my tractor. I thought that's why he pulled me over, but that wasn't it. But check it out, I fixed it. This light was out. So I thought, so I thought that's why he got me for that light out right there. But now according to the paper right here, he didn't get me for that. He got me for the chassis real lights being out. And for the um for my ELD or my phone, cause I use my phone for my log, wasn't mounted to the truck and my windshield wiper fluid. I ain't have none. So that's why he got me. But anyway, like I said, YouTube, when stuff like this happens, it happens to the best of us. Even I got got, you know, all the time, you know. It happens to all of us, man. And um, when it happened, just lick your wounds, man. Keep on going. Once he got finished with me, I ain't want to drive no more. You know what I'm saying? I want to just pull over somewhere. I want to pull over somewhere and just go to sleep, man. I want to go to sleep. Needless to say, it was a really long day. Because he held me there about an hour. Plus, I had like another hour and a half to go get to the real yard. But anyway, anywho. All right, YouTube. I thought I'd share this video. Maybe to help somebody out there out, give them a little more understanding of what's going on around here. And so in the meantime, between time, trucking the life is out.